In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix your Canon Pixima G6020 printer that is printing the blank pages. First step is to open the chamber, lift this section and look inside. If you see there is an ink in the pipes, that means print head is clogged or the nozzles are clogged. If you don't see ink here, that means you need ink flush. Right now, we will do the print head cleaning. Close this section. Lift the screen and go to the printer display panel. So first step is to click on the setting icon. Scroll ahead. Select maintenance. Scroll ahead. Click on the cleaning option. Cleaning is the automatic and the basic step to unclog the print heads. It fix all the inks. It doesn't matter if one of the ink is not working or if all the inks are not working. This also saves a lot of ink because it uses little ink for the cleaning. General cleaning is done. Next step is to print the nozzle check sheet. Scroll back, click on the nozzle check. It's going to print a nozzle check sheet and that will give an idea. Let's check the print result. So you can see all the inks has started to work but some of the ink like the magenta and yellow is still not working enough. So what we will do, we will go to the printer display panel. Scroll ahead and click on the cleaning. So this is the second time we are going to do it. You may have to repeat it few times. Let's check how many times we do to get the proper result. Again the cleaning is done. We will print the nozzle check sheet again. Scroll back and press OK. So it looks like there is a little bit improvement. Also there is a line in the black ink here. Now we can go for the cleaning third time. You can keep repeating it until you get the proper result and if everything fails then you can do the ink flush and even for the ink flush I will give you the technique to use that so that you don't waste a lot of ink. So I'm just going to do the cleaning for the final time now and we'll do a copy test after that. Cleaning is done again. Let's print the nozzle check sheet. For most of the printers after doing few cleanings the result will definitely improve. For some printers it may not work like that. So right now it's printed. Let's do a copy test. This will give an idea like if everything is being so that is the copy button. So here we can see it has started to print but all the inks here are not working as they should be. Now we are going to do a ink flush. 
for the ink flush first we have to go to the printer display panel click on the setting maintenance and then look for the option ink flush select all colors press ok confirm yes and yes again it will display like it's going to take around 8 minutes so we'll only give just one minute for the printer because in 8 minutes it will waste a lot of ink so we don't want to waste the ink just wait for 30 seconds now I'm going to unplug the power cable so unplug it Press the power button few times and then plug it in again. Switch on the printer. So this will prevent the loss of the ink from the printer. Because if you do the 8 minute process, it will definitely go down and you will waste it. Wait for the printer to start and then we will do the copy test again. So let's do the copy and all things are not showing properly that means still have to do the cleaning process for few times more and you can just continue that process until you get the desired result so this will help you to save a lot of ink because in other process like deep cleaning and ink flush it wastes a lot of ink hopefully this will help you to fix your printer that is printing the blank pages and over few hours after printing it will start to print normal so once you get this page that means your printer ink has started to work now just wait for couple of hours and do the general cleaning again so that printer gets enough time and it starts to work normal hopefully this will help you to fix your printer that is printing the blank pages for some printers it may take one or two cleanings for for other printers it may take little bit more thanks for watching